ladies and gentlemen, Michael Palmisano here. Hope you're having a great day. So, back on the mothership on Guitargate, and Cyrus Green Jr. hits me with a little Jamie Johnson in color live at the Grand Ole Opry. Now, I love this song. I've heard it. I think I've even way back in the day taught a lesson on this song. But, um, you know, it's always good to revisit an old friend. This is just one of these perfect perfectly crafted songs um and so i figure why not let's revisit it and uh so cyrus thanks for being a lifetime member on the site and uh let's jump in here I said, Grandpa, what's this picture here? It's all black and white, and it ain't real clear. Is that you there? He said, yeah, I was loving. Love the pace. And times were tough back in 35. That's me and Uncle Joe trying to survive a cotton farm and a Great Depression. If it looks like we were scared to death Like a couple of kids just trying to save each other You should have seen it in color This one Okay, so for those of you unfamiliar with this song The song's all about pictures, right? And so it's, it's, it's the story of a life shown in pictures. Um, and I love how he starts it out. Um, you know, I love how he starts it out in just a super slow pace. Like he's not keeping time. No one else in the band has come in yet. And he's just filling the room with his voice. The guitar is a little out of tune. But it's just like, listen to what I'm saying. I love that so much. And and it's so great. There's just that little pedal steel, just the hint that the band's about to come in before it does, and you just get one chorus, and the band kind of, it, it just kind of like limps in and lingers there, right? And then it shimmers out for the second verse. It's such a testament to the tune. One of these days... One of these days, we're going to get this figured out. Here was taken overseas in the middle of hell, 1943, in the wintertime. Wintertime. You can almost see my breath. That was my tail gunner, old Johnny McGee. Harmony's coming was in. a high school teacher from New Orleans, and he had my back right through the day we left. You should have seen it in color. A picture's worth a thousand words, but you can't see what those shades of gray keep covered. You should have seen it in color. All right, so real quick, your harmony here. You got a one flat seven four or five, four, one, however you want to look at it, um, in B flat. So we got B flat, A flat, E flat. I, th I think of it as a one, flat seven, four, because you always want to have your tonic, you want to think of your home bass as one. Um, but those three major uh, chords are in fact in the key of E flat as a five, a four, and a one. What's so cool about this, um, there's so many things so great about this song. Uh, I would encourage all of you to look at the lyrics and really spend some time with this song because it's just, it's perfect songwriting craftsmanship. It really is. You know, the concept of you have these multiple phases of your life caught in a picture, right? And each one, you know, 
if it looks like we were scared to death, right? Each, each one has the same punchline, right? The first one, you know, this is me and grandpa, like we were in the middle of a cotton farm and trying to survive the Great Depression, you know, it's in black and white. The second one, you know, we're in World War II, uh, you know, that's my tail gunner, Johnny McGee, you can almost see my breath. Um, it, it's, it's these phases of life taken in snapshots, right? But, but the punchline is all, is the same, um, you know, but you should have been there. You should have seen it in color because I did. It's, it's such a great song. I'm such a huge fan of this one. Let's keep it going. And when you take that lead, we're, play, we're staying straight on B flat major. Pentatonic for the most part and you want to keep it straight down the middle. Root, root, root. He's aiming right for this root here. Trying to keep it close to the melody. That wasn't what he played, but I'm just saying your approach to this, a song like this, man, simple, as close to the melody as possible. Play as little as possible. Let it shimmer back down for the third verse. See, all the way down. This one is my favorite one. Me and me, Ma, in the summer sun. All dressed up the day we said our vows. Using the grandparent name. You can't tell it here, but it was hot that June. Oh. That rose was red and her eyes were blue. And just look at that smile, son. I was so proud. That's the story of my life. Right there in black and white. If it looks like we were scared to death Like a couple of kids just trying to save each other You should have seen it in color A picture's worth a thousand words But you can't see what those shades of gray keep covering You should have seen it in color Oh, so many great things just happened. Okay. And I love that the third one is his favorite one, where he got married on their wedding day. It was hot that June, right? Me and Mima, he used the grandparents' name because he's talking to his grandson. Just so many beautiful things. But on the performance side, check this. That rose was red and her eyes were blue and just look at that smile, son. I was so proud. Now listen, he comes in a cappella. He's got to keep his tune. You hear him very lightly start to finger the different chords behind it to give him that anchor. Just wait for it. So you got your relative minor here. That's the story of my life. Little miss there. Right there in black and white. Listen, here comes the acapella. If it looks like we were scared to death, like a couple of kids just right there, trying adding to in the chords. save each other, you should have seen it in color. Listen to it reverberate through the theater. He's not, he's not, he's not holding out the other. He's, he's, he's squeezing off the er in color and letting it just reverberate and listen to how it bounces. Full of kids just trying to save each other. You should have seen it in color. Yeah, you see that look to the crowd? He's back in it. Such a pro. A picture's worth a thousand words, but you can't see what those shades of gray keep covering. You should have seen it in color. Yeah. 
guitar players, same thing up here. Uh, right? It's just B flat major pentatonic up there. Pictures worth a thousand words, but you can't see what those shades of gray. Bass starts walking around. You should have seen Love that hit. it in color. I mean, it's literally a perfect song. Cyrus Green Jr., thank you so much for being a member on the website. Uh, anybody else that'd like to join, it's guitargate.com. You get all 12 of my courses. You get access to the community. You get to pick what comes next on YouTube. Um, and uh, we get to find new music together. Um, Jamie Johnson is one of the best. This is one of the most... I don't know who wrote this song, if he wrote it, if he had help, or... It doesn't matter. This is a perfect song. This is a perfect song song um and it doesn't require any fat it doesn't require anything extra uh i would encourage all of you to dig deep into this type of stuff and try to hunt for the middle like i do try to hunt for the core of what connects with people and write and perform and improvise from that place that's what i try to do that's what i try to tell myself every day i love you all have a great day cheers